So everyone wants to make money and a lot of times people feel that they have income potential outside of their core, core you know, life career, which is seeing patients as an optometrist. And so when I'm on the road doing talks and things like that, I hear the question come up a lot is, hey, what can I do to get involved outside of just patient care? You know, because that's somewhat limited. You, you see patients, if you're on production income, you can definitely make more income that way. But what about a life outside of that? And, and this topic is really interesting for a few different reasons. One, and I think the most core important thing, is that we, as eye care professionals, need to start innovating within our own profession. I see too many people have great ideas and they just fall by the wayside. And then we look at other individuals and other great companies, and you guys know who they are, innovating and then disrupting our own profession. But why don't we take a moment to step aside from the exam room to do those things ourselves? And so I'd say out of, if I do 10 talks during the year, I'll find a good 15 or 20 people with actually really, really good ideas. Whatever that might be, sometimes they're clinical, sometimes they're associated with media, but they usually relate back to the core profession. And I think a lot of people have those ideas. And how do you make them come to life? Or, or where do you even begin with good ideas? Well, the one entry path that can help someone to do things outside of their core profession of seeing patients is media, is writing, is putting yourself out there. So people have come to me and say, well, research, you know, I do research. How do I start here? What do I do? Or people have come to me and say, I have this great idea and a few friends who want to start it and it involves, you know, patient care. What do I do? Well, write about it. Get it out there on a, on a media outlet. I mean, the media is always hungry for stories. They're more so willing to accept stories and writers than they are to turn them away. And so by actually authoring these posts yourself about, even if it's just very blog-like, you know, here are my thoughts on this topic, it can really resonate. All you need is one really good person to kind of pick it up and say, hey, this is, this is good. And so writing about some of these things is great. LinkedIn is a really good you know, means for this now. You can actually have your own blog within your LinkedIn profile now. Or Medium is a really good blog publishing platform that syndicates out to a lot of different people. And so writing is a great way to get into the field. Other things you want to consider is consulting as a, a subject matter expert. It doesn't just need to be on clinical care. It could be on marketing, social media, whatever that might be. Um, if you're a new graduate, your new graduate opinion, never, never before in history, has someone who's you know, 27, 28, 30, 31 years old able to sit in front of a CEO of a major company and actually have everyone writing notes being like, oh my God, this is, this is amazing what this, what this person is telling us. Because you as a millennial, you as this new graduate, really have a unique take on, on really everything about uh, this new generation. So you can contribute a lot of value, specifically in the digital space and social space. Um, so in addition to those things, consulting, writing, uh, doing things revolving media, web development. It may seem like it's a far away thing for you to learn, but trust me, web development and coding is actually becoming a lot easier. And that can go a lot of different places. And then you just really got to look inside yourself and say, what is my core like love? What did I love to do? Was it making music? Was it making art? You know, look at those things that you really like and figure out how they can take you to a different place. But one thing's for sure. Don't let your passion or something you have inside just sit there. Bring it out in a small way. And hey, here's actually the opening here. If you want to do something and you're not sure how to do it, contact me. If I can't help you, I, won't, I, I just will tell you and perhaps I can introduce you to someone who can. The comments, maybe they're like right here or something. Comment right there. Or if not, send it right to me. Hello at covalentcareers.com. That's, our, that's, my in, that's my direct mailbox and I'll be able to take all of those inquiries and let's talk. Let's talk about a couple of ideas that you may have and I'm happy to help. Yep, this may go out to hopefully thousands of people. Bring it on, let's do it. But this is really important. We need to innovate. We need to be spectacular in our healthcare field.